I achieved my goal, made that money, day one complete. So Tuesday, it is uh, August 20th, 6.29 a.m. and I'm on my way to Walgreens to pick up a few things for somebody. They decided to message me the moment I accepted the offer and they're like, thanks for shopping for me. I'm like, uh-huh. <laughs> Okay, we're shopping for a lot of stuff. Cetaphil, hairspray, CeraVe makeup remover, Batista dry shampoo, Garnier Skin Active, San Pellegrino mineral water, and Tide detergent. Customer messages you and tells you how grateful they are to pick it up. A lot of times what that means is that somebody else tried to do their shopping and got so frustrated they just gave up and, and canceled the order and left. And so they're, they're probably really worried they're not going to get their order because nobody wants to complete and fulfill the order that they put in because it's su such a headache. Darn things are sometimes not in the travel section. All right, I got everything out of here. Next one on the list from DoorDash uh, is uh, we're going to go to Panera and then uh, got to go to uh, Denny's, $13.75, 6.2 miles. Thank you. Stop Denny's. Got the Denny's order, and the first drop off is going to be the Denny's order. Thank you so You're much. You're welcome. I appreciate Have, you. Okay, take care. Thank you. Yeah, easy. Thank you. Next delivery is coming from Uber Eats. It is a, a trip to Einstein Bagels for $9.10 for 3.3 miles. Thank you. So, one up is from DoorDash. We're going to get some good money. We're going to be getting $16.71 for 5.9 miles shopping for two customers.
I'm all done. I'm out of here. Drop off the uh, one with the water. God, I hope it's not on the second floor. one up is from DoorDash six dollars and 25 cents for two miles shopping at Target for five items I don't believe it's two miles because just for me to get there it's 1.6 miles so we'll see that was it just five packs of paper plates that's all I had to get let's go something for DoorDash? No? Okay, let's be next door then. The customer didn't put the name of their uh, suite number, so I wasn't able to figure out uh, where to go. So I went, I tried going into a sushi place that was locked. I went into a burger place and the lady said, no, we didn't order anything. And uh, yeah, <laughs> then I went to the third door and that door was locked. And then I started to, to call the customer to figure out what I'm supposed to do. And they, um, they told me to, uh, well, no. <laughs> I tried to call the customer and they didn't answer, but then suddenly the door for that restaurant, I think it was Cafe Zupa's, they finally unlocked the door and the person came out and grabbed the paper plates. And now I've got this next one coming up and it's the last one. I'm sure I've gone over my $60. It's been real busy today and it's only 9.13 a.m. It's gonna be to go to Walgreens to shop for six items, $11.75 for five miles. the last one and of course I've got to drop it off into some high-rise security building it always ends up being difficult at the end but at least I'm near I'm close to home so that's one good thing it wraps up the day it went really fast it is 9 37 a.m that's probably the earliest i finished in a long time and uh, now i'm headed off to the market i've got to pick up some stuff for dinner they usually have some pretty good deals on uh stuff at smith's on uh tuesdays because most people aren't shopping on tuesdays and in the dally section they got some really good uh some good deals on uh enchiladas and pizzas so i'm gonna go check that out you guys all have a good one. Eddie, it is Wednesday, August 21st. It's 5.58 a.m. And I got an order through Uber Eats for a Starbucks. $6.23, 2.5 miles. Turn right on Pebble Road. Okay, thanks. I do have a right. Yes, Oh, my God. That's the worst. Okay, awesome. Thank you. Oh, Springs Drive. Turn right.
right on Fountain Springs Drive. Drop off. Don't knock. Leave outside the gate. I can see when it's delivered. Hello. Thank you. You're welcome. Have a good day. Thank you. Thank you. It's uh, 6.46 a.m. and we're on our way to Roberto's. I got this one from Uber Eats. $6.69 for 2.5 miles. Pick up. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Turn left. Thank you. Have a good one. Thank you. Shopping order from DoorDash. I'm going to be going over to Sprouts. I'm getting uh, $25.08 for 4.3 miles. And I'm going to be shopping for 22 items. I'm going to be shopping for chicken breast, diced, tilapia, cherry tomatoes, mushrooms, broccoli, spinach, mixed salad avocado, apple slices, eggs, butter, raw jumbo wild caught something. Is that shrimp? Yeah, shrimp. Yeah, that's right. What else? I'm parking. Uh, sea scallops. Uh, crab meat. That's a lot of weird items. More shrimp. These people love shrimp. I think that's it. No, there's more. Oh, God. It goes on forever. Onions. Garden salad. Watermelon spears. Diced bell peppers. Okay, that is it. Let's go. I got just about everything. There were a couple of things that were out of stock, but it's all good. Let's check out. Everything went fine on the shopping. It was just the first item they didn't have in stock. It was this this uh, this box of crab meat, and man, I spent so much time looking for that dumb crab meat. It wasn't even funny, but finally I just gave up on it and moved on, and then everything went smooth. There's just a couple more things I didn't have in stock, but it all worked out. And now I'm headed off to, uh, let's see, a house, leave at the door. Four minutes from here, 2.4 miles. The customer requested you leave the order at their door. They added the following instructions. Leave at my door. This takes so long to get into.
going to be the last one of the day and it's from DoorDash. I'm going to go shop at Albertsons for 21 items. I'm getting $28.75 for 8.2 miles. This is going to be the shortest day on record. It is 8.18 a.m. right now and I should finish probably within an hour so probably by 9.15 I'll be done. I think that beats the record of yet yesterday's record. Yesterday, I think, was the previous record. I think I finished at about 9.30 or 9.45. Okay, we're shopping for raspberries. Uh, what the heck? A uh, navel orange. Another kind of orange. Two different kinds of oranges. Banana. Strawberries. Blackberries. Strawberry banana sports drink emergency bread some kind of gummies and then some Naxaprim sodium some type of signature care pain relief of some sort These supplements are hard to find. I found it. All right, I'm out of here. Let's go. I don't know why they were just blasting that music in the store today. It's giving me a headache. We're going to head off to a house not too far from here, 1.5 miles. And I'm going to have to call them when I'm at the gate. It's one of those special gates where you have to call the customer and then inside their house they press a button. All right, we're coming up on the gate. Maybe I can enter something into this call box to find their name. Open the gate. I called you and we had a nice conversation. Okay, there she goes. She's Instructions are provided in the Dasher app. everybody that's it for um, Wednesday got that in the can and uh, it's only uh, 857 a.m. so I broke a record for the shortest day ever so I'm glad that uh, went quickly and I, I think I'm well over $60 so it's, it's even better news so um, yeah so that's it. it it all worked out really good today there were no Take the next major step the issues drive, then turn right that happen so I don't really have any complaints to make uh, today everything was pretty smooth and uh, the weather was good and the drop-offs were pretty easy so it was pretty much an ideal day overall so, right I'll see you guys on um, Thursday <laughs>